Hi everybody, just a quick video today to look at one strategy for comparing files such that we can quickly tell what may be different between them. Uh, I know there's a lot of techniques out there to do something like this, but in today's video we'll be looking at a free utility called Design Review. So to get started, I've got a drawing here that contains uh, plan sheets, a number of sheets as a matter of fact, and I'd like to have some changes made, and those changes will be performed by somebody else. Now, uh, when I get the sheets back, or when I get the drawing file back, I'd like to ensure, maybe have some confidence of the things that they changed were the things that I requested, and that maybe other things within the model uh, weren't changed if I didn't ask those things to be changed. So is there a quick way that I can compare the before and after results of the drawing file? And there is, and we'll do it through the tool called Design Review. So to begin, what I'm going to do is I'm going to create a, an electronic plot of this sheet to a DWF file. That's the file format that we'll leverage in Design Review. I'm going to go ahead and put it on my desktop here in a folder, and we'll call this our Before. We'll save that. It'll generate our electronic print, and we're ready to go. Now let's make the assumption we've sent this out, and someone has performed changes in it. So, for example, maybe we'll move the uh, north arrow here uh, so that it's not obstructed by the line. That's correct. And then maybe these same people maybe perform some other um, changes that weren't necessarily requested. Let's uh, drill down and look at the model a little bit. Maybe perhaps uh, we'll make an ever so slight change to the location of one of my sanitary sewer structures. Let's uh, pop back out to model space or to my paper space or my layout view. You see that it's changed, but it's it's very subtle. Maybe not something that I would pick up immediately. At the same time, maybe some other things were added to the sheet. Let's come up here to insert. Let's add maybe another symbol representing a tree or something like that that was put in. All right, so we've uh, we've made the changes that were requested. Some other things that maybe weren't, but once again, they're fairly subtle. That uh, could be a problem uh, if I don't notice those when it comes back. All right, so what I can do is when the file is returned to me, what we can do is we can take and create another print of this, the DWF. This one we'll call after. And we'll go ahead and let that run through. Now when those are complete, then I'm going to take and, and launch my design, review, my design review tool. Once again, it's a free tool, probably installed when your uh, Autodesk utility was installed, whether it be Civil 3D or uh, AutoCAD or MAP. Let's flip over. We'll uh, grab hold of one of those sheets. It's already associated with my DWF files, so I'm going to grab my uh, Tuesday folder here. And we'll start with Before. Design review launches, and we see the electronic version of my, my sheet. Uh, it's actually very nice, the uh, fidelity. I can zoom in quite a bit. Um, works, uh, works great. I can plot from here. We can do markups. This tool does a number of things perhaps we can explore in subsequent videos. But in today's video, what I want to do is focus on what might have changed between this version and the version that I got back. Well, if I come up to the ribbon, there is a... Uh, option up here called Tools, and if we come down underneath it, we've got Compare Sheets. So when I select Compare Sheets, what I'm going to go ahead and do is we'll select the After version of the same sheet. So we'll grab After, bring that in, and when I click on OK, it automatically creates for us, uh, it, it scans both sheets, and it creates those things that are additions, and then also deletions, so we can immediately see those things that are different between sheets. Now if I come in and look, I can see that the north arrow has been moved, maybe one of the, the things that I had suggested be changed, so it was deleted and added in this location. However, uh, it also very quickly, I can see that uh, there were some changes here, that uh, my sanitary sewer was moved, and if we come over and look in, uh, in this area here, let me pan, come over here and look in this area, I've all of a sudden got uh, trees showing up that, that weren't there before. All right, so once again, uh, from here I can elect to either go back to the version that I had or address the changes with the person who made them or you know just give me some idea of what needs to be corrected to get it back into the, uh, the state that it should be. All right, so once again, very, uh, very, very quick tool uh, just by leveraging a, a DWF file for both the before and after. 
I can quickly determine any additions or deletions that have been made to my sheets, both the ones that I wanted and more importantly the ones that perhaps I didn't. So hope this has been helpful and I'll talk to you again soon. See ya.